Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, blue shaded uh, quadrilateral uh, EFCE fully confined uh, in a bigger quadrilateral uh, ABCD as you can see in this uh, diagram such that uh, the area of this uh, blue shaded uh, region uh, is uh, 605 uh, centimeter square and its uh, side length uh, EA is uh, being represented by X and its uh, other side length uh, CF is uh, 33 centimeter and moreover uh, this uh, side length uh, CD is uh, 44 centimeter and this uh, side length uh, AB is uh, 2x and furthermore uh, these angles uh, EDC is uh, 90 degrees and likewise this angle uh, ABF is uh, 90 degree as well and now our task is uh, to find the value of uh, x please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And now let's focus on this uh, blue shaded uh, region. This area has been given to us as uh, 605 uh, centimeter square. And now we are going to think uh, outside the box and we are going to manipulate uh, this uh, blue quadrilateral. And we are going to draw some uh, auxiliary lines. So therefore I'm going to connect uh, this point uh, A and this point uh, C as you can see in this uh, next step and now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, blue quadrilateral has been divided into two triangles this triangle and this uh, triangle and now let's assume the area of this uh, triangle uh, EAC is represented by A then the area of this uh, other triangle uh, CF uh, is going to be this total area minus uh, this area. So this is going to become uh, 605 minus uh, area A. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, EAC. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times the base uh, times height in our case uh, the base uh, of this uh, triangle uh, EAC is uh, X this is uh, the base of this triangle and this uh, CD is the height uh, of this uh, triangle uh, EAC and furthermore uh, the area of this uh, triangle is uh, uppercase A so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, triangle formula so our area in this uh, triangle is going to be a equals to a half uh, times our base uh, is uh, x times our height uh, is uh, 44 centimeter so let's simplify so our uppercase a is going to be equal to 22 times uh, x i'm going to label this one as our equation number one and now let's focus on this uh, other triangle uh, CFA and now let's recall once again the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times base uh, times height and for this uh, triangle uh, CFA this side uh, is uh, going to be our base uh, of this triangle and this side uh, AB is going to be the height uh, of this uh, triangle furthermore uh, the area of this triangle uh, CFA uh, is uh, 605 minus A so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula so area for this triangle CFA is uh, 605 minus A equals to a half times our base uh, is 33 times uh, the height is uh, 2 times uh, x let's go ahead and simplify so we got uh, 605 minus uh, a is going to be equal to we can see this 2 and 2 is gone so we are ended up with simply 33 times uh, x and i'm going to label this one as our equation uh, number 2 so thus we are ended up with these uh, two equations and now we are going to add uh, both of these equations 
And if we add the left hand side, we can see this A and negative A, they are gone. So we ended up with simply 605 on the left hand side is going to be equal to 22x plus 33x is going to give us 55 times x. And now I'm going to divide both sides by 55 to isolate x. And here we can see this 55 and 55 is gone. So therefore, our x value turns out to be 11 centimeter. So thus after all the manipulations, our x value turns out to be 11 centimeter. So therefore, our this uh, x value is going to be 11 uh, centimeter. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.